To remove the hard drive, first remove the access panel and the front bezel. Remove the graphics card retaining bracket if installed in the unit. Next, detach the three screws that secure the hard drive cage to the PC. Push down and hold the latch on the side of the cage. Then slide the cage up and lift it out of the PC. Remove the power and data cables from the back of the drive before fully removing the drive cage. Note that the serial ATA power and data connectors each have a latch that must be squeezed to remove the connector. Next, remove the four screws, two on each side, that secure the hard drive to the cage. Slide the hard drive out of the top of the drive cage. To install the hard drive, slide the drive into the cage until the screw holes on the side of the hard drive and cage align. Make sure the connectors are at the top of the cage. Replace the four screws. Slide the new drive into the first open cage bay until the screw holes on the side of the hard drive and cage align. Attach four screws, two on each side, to secure the drive to the cage. Connect power and data connectors to the back of the new drive as well as to the existing drive. Attach the new serial ATA data connector for the new drive to the motherboard. The hard drive cage has five tabs at the back that fit into five slots on the wall of the PC. The cage also has six tabs on its side that fit into six slots on the front of the PC. To replace the hard drive cage, align the tabs on the back and side of the cage with the slots on the PC and slide the cage down until it snaps into place. Reattach the three drive cage screws.